Okay, so into this Grand Peace Online video, we'll actually be coming for Folger Law with his Operation Food. And to do this, we're gonna have to complete a bunch of steps. So, actually, you guys to complete your steps as well, which, real quick, hit the like button and subscribe. Step one is to get one of the rarest fruits in this entire game. It is a mythical fruit. It's called the Operation Fruit or the OP OP Fruit, whatever you guys wanna call it, but this is actually Law's fruit. Step two is to get the super rare mythical 0.1% Kikoku Sword because this is indeed Law's Sword. Step three is to do the factory raid over and over again and beat the Law Boss in it over and over again until we get his super rare drops because law does have a bunch of drops like his cape his hat and his outfit and the final step is once we become law we're gonna have to save dress rosa by defeating doflamingo we're just gonna go ahead and buy a mythic chest so i do have 15 legendary chests and i do have some robux so yeah that's pretty expensive but i'm willing to do it for you guys there we go we got one mythical chest and here's the mythic chest we're about to open in three two one let's see what we get and bro we just got tori bro that sucks though. It's fine. We're gonna buy another one because why not? Here we go. Let's hope to get the fruit we need. 1,500 more Robux down the drain. And yup, there's a quick bit right here. It's time to open it. Once again, this is the second mythic chest boat. These things are very expensive. So please subscribe and hit that like button. Though here we go. Three, two, one. Mythic chest and oh no way bro we got OP the new fruit let's go by the way if you guys want to join the discord server for my new roblox one piece game called world peace check the link in the description and the pinned comment for tester giveaways sneaks and much more so now we're in the main game and we did just get the operation fruit as you guys just saw there here it is it's looking beautiful though yeah we're about to eat it it's a mythical fruit looking really cool though here we go eating in three seconds cancel by deselecting and after this so first i'm gonna of course just showcase this thing really quickly then we'll go ahead and fight the law boss at the factory over and over again till we get all of his drops here's the first move it's just room so yep look at this we can just hold it down i think to make it bigger and boom so first of all we can just swap places with him look shambles boom swap places so the first move it's called thorn so look at this thorn really really cool and i'm pretty sure the longer you hold it the more damage it does which is pretty cool and now we've got attack so look at this i summon a bunch of rocks boom and we can just fire him right down at this boy and look at that damage bro that's some nice damage and now we've got counter shock which is a really cool move look at this three two one counter shock look at that man that is insane and now we have surgeon mode so when you press y look at this now we have a new move called mess so three two one mess and look we grab this boy's heart and look what happens when we click boom click it and we can just keep clicking it over and over again like bro this damage is so nice on this fruit and now we have radio knife which is the next move and this also does an insane amount of damage like, and next up injection shot which is equally as cool uh, not as much damage now for the ultimate it's called gamma knife so three two one gamma knife and look at this we grab him do this and boom bro this is some insane damage bro that damage all right so we're in the factory raid because law should spawn here but to make law spawn here we need to first get the factory to alert level three and to do that we're gonna have to beat this thing a few times Just like that, and now the factory should be tier 1, so let's beat it again. Another factory down, I'm pretty sure one more to go. Core is finally vulnerable, so let's break it and then, yeah, we're gonna be on to law. Beat it again, now the next factory should have the law boss. Law has finally spawned, but I know for a fact that he's actually super overpowered, so we're gonna have to be a little careful. Got that boy with gamma knife nice we're about to do a ton of damage look at that boy look at that damn oh no law has got me in his gamma knife done damn bro it's about to hurt i'm ready to be one shot and 
Oh, hey, thankfully we never got one shot. That's at least a good thing. Let's get him in internal flow and never mind. Well, let's we'll grab Law's heart because why not? And he will let's spam click it till he's dead. And okay, the lava has started rising, so we're gonna have to, you know, kind of hurry this up. Got low with Gamma Knife once again. Hopefully this block breaks him. And okay, bro, this is Magu. Oh, it's all over my screen. And rip, we died to the lava. So here we go, Law has spawned, and we actually have got to make sure that we do get a nice amount of damage in, otherwise, you know, we won't get credit for his items. So, got Law and my Gamma Knife, but bro, I legit cannot see anything. Got that boy in Gamma Knife again. Let's see how much damage we're gonna do. And yeah, that's nice. Come on, 500 HP is about to die, and and he dropped 44 HP, 29 HP, 15, 0, and oh, no way, bro, we got Law's cap on our first try, let's go. So let's just go ahead and put the hat on, it should be somewhere here, here it is, Law's, put it on, and yeah, it looks pretty cool. Law is dead and bro, no way, let's go, we go Law's outfit, that's, that's one more item, now we just need Law's sword and his cape. Look at this guys, we finally got a drop, this time the drop is the Ope Scramble, I'm pretty sure, yo, this is actually a grip, so look at this, Ope Scramble, we have it equipped and yeah, pretty cool. Look at that guys, we finally got a drop and yeah, it's Law's cape, so let's go ahead and put it on. It's right here, Law's cape, a cape worn by the strong pirate Law, we're just gonna put it on and look at this, it looks really cool. It also gives some really nice stat buffs, but look how it like moves around, that's really, really nice. So we're just not gonna get Law's sword because it's way too rare, I just found it's a 0.1% chance to get, so let's move on to the next step. So the next step is to fight Doflamingo, so first we gotta beat up his family to summon Pika, and after killing Pika, Doflamingo should spawn, so... You know, here's the first dude, right here, we're just gonna beat this boy up. Go, let's use tact, and I just wanna show you guys a little combo, look at this. Basically, fully charged tact, look what happened, Z, and then counter shock, and look at that damage, bro. That damage is insane, and right after you use your ultimate too, bro, like, this fruit is so overpowered, I don't even know what to say. Just look at this, bro. Like, how can you tell me this is balanced, bro? This is not balanced at all, though. Boom. And injection shot. You know what? We'll finish this boy off with mess. There we go. And wait, what? I don't know why my mess never works. That's fine. Thorn. And we'll finish him off with counter shock. GG's, bro. And yeah, there's one family member dead. And one more thorn, probably, into counter shock. And yeah, second one's dead too. And counter shock. And another one's dead. And gamma knife. And they should probably be dead after this gamma knife. And after this Pika, which is a huge, really cool boss, should spawn. And once we kill Pika, of course, Doflamingo should spawn. And yup, look at that. Pika has indeed spawned, we can see something right there. Bro, look at that, something is climbing out of there, and yeah, bro, that boy is huge, man. We're gonna have to beat this thing up, and mind you guys, his voice sounds very, very weird and annoying, so uh, yeah, just giving you guys a heads up. Oh, nah, look at Pika, bro, he's trying to punch me real quick, though. It's fine, you go room, and tact as well, and bro, oh, nah, yeah, I, I don't think Ope is gonna be good fruit for this, because this dude just keeps jumping around and running out of my room. All right, he's finally about to jump off. Come on, bro, just fall off, and we're just gonna use tact, so as soon as he falls off, we're gonna get him, and yup, this boy is falling, and all right, he just fell, and... Okay, damn, that hurt though. Hugo, tact, please work. And there we go, we finally got some damage in. And let's see, will Gamma Knife work on him? And okay, yup, of course, Gamma Knife doesn't work on him because he is just so, so big though. 
we'll just try to do the best job we can so I'll see you guys when he's dead. Here we go, Pika is finally dead and we did actually get his drop as well. And look at this, his Doflamingo will be arriving at the mansion in 15 minutes. So let's go there. Look at this, Doflamingo has finally arrived. He's spawning, look at this cool little cutscene. And you know what? Here we go, we're just gonna summon our room. And oh nah, bro. Oh nah, bro, this man is calming me up right now. Bro, this is not good. Here we go, room and just M1 this boy. There we go, thorn on him. And let's use our move where we use tact and then our counter shock. So we're gonna use it right about now. Here we go, three. Two, one, tact and counter shock and okay, bro. You know what? Let's grab Dope Flamingo's heart because why not? And we're just gonna yep keep squeezing like this and damn, bro, that is some nice damage. All right, attempt two of our tact into counter shock strategy. So let's try it out here. Here we go, counter shock and bro, I missed again. Alright, attempt three of this, so here we go, please, and bro, I keep messing it up. Here we go, Gamma Knife, and there we go, we finally hit Doflamingo. Oh, whoa, no way, look at that damage, bro. We just did 1,500 damage with that. Time to Gamma Knife this boy once again because our cooldown is off, and there we go. Got a minute and let's see how much damage it's gonna do right now. So look at this. Get ready guys. And damn bro. He's almost at half HP, which is pretty good. So here we go. Come on. Just die already, boy. And he's so close to being at half. And there we go. He's at half HP. Now he's in stage two. So I'm pretty sure we gotta do something like basically we gotta break his birdcage. Let's see what Doflamingo's about to do. And yup. This boy just activated birdcage. Oh now nah, we gotta be quick. We gotta be quick here. So for the people that don't know what we're supposed to do, we're supposed to go to these red X's and look what happens. We're just gonna go to this one right here because you know it's pretty close. So Yep, there's gonna be some people here, and we just gotta beat up all of these dudes. And basically, once we beat them up, you guys will see what's gonna happen. So, you go attack, just absolutely shred their HP. Nice, man. And oh, damn, I forgot to say, these guys do have some very, very overpowered fruits. So, you gotta be a little careful. There we go. And radio knife, and oh, damn, bro. Okay, that mirror does some nice damage. And bro, a ice user too? Like, what the heck, bro? How did these guys even get such insane fruits? But you will mess on that boy. This, and attack into counter shock. Boom, some nice damage, of course, and he's dead. And now, look at this. Basically, we fired this cannon, and yep, look, it does a bunch of damage to the birdcage. And my teammates and me have to fire all these cannons to break this birdcage, and then we can continue the fight. Alright, we're in another cannon. Let's use our ultimate on this guard right here because who cares? We might as well waste it. Nice, and okay, sadly, I don't think that's gonna one shot him. And wait, I think it did one shot him. This boy's almost dead. Just get him with Thorn, and there we go. Let's fire this cannon, and boom. Fired it and yo, yeah, look at this. The bird cage is going back to Doflamingo, so we're gonna have to be quick. Finally, back up here, and Doflamingo is waiting for us nicely here. So, get him Gamma Knife, and pretty sure we're gonna do 1500 damage to this boy once again. And yeah, once again, you guys gotta get OP if you can because the damage on this fruit is just so so nice, bro. Alright, here we go, tacked into counter shock, and oh, we go on a nice little combo. Of, look at that, that was some amazing damage though. Right with this, Gamma Knife, because why not? Come on, Gamma Knife, and there we go. Got that boy in Gamma Knife too. Nah, man. We're shredding Doflamingo. Doflamingo is crying right now, bro.
Alright, Doflamingo finally died, and yeah, we just beat him, and we did get one of his drops, which is pretty cool. Anyways, so that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Drop a like and sub, and see you guys in the next video.